Okay, so let's talk about a one more hidden gem AI video generator that offers you a consistent characters in A videos. It offers you a text to video, it offers you an image to video, and you guys can even generate images inside of this AI tool just like Mid Journey. So, what this AI tool is, let's find out. Okay, so the tool that I'm talking about is called Pixverse AI, and this is the website. And if you scroll down, you can see a few example videos that people have generated, and it looks really good. If we look at this abundant house, it looks really really natural and one more example right now the christmas season is going on uh, so you can also create a greeting video so all you have to do is simply select the person that you want in your video so let's say i'm gonna go ahead with a Lionel messi and here you have to type your message so i'm gonna type like merry christmas from messi and team and hit generate so here's the video and let me play this for you Yeah, there's a really beautiful song playing on the background, but I cannot play this because maybe because of the copyright issues. Now let's access this AI tool. So you can simply click on this join beta and you will be redirected to his Discord server, right? Right now we are on their Discord server and this is the quick guide. So on the left side, you can see uh, we have some channels, right? Uh, so I'm going to click on that and uh, here we have some videos. Now to generate the video, you simply have to type forward slash and here we have different options like the create, animate, create single, meme face, settings that I'm going to explain right in the video. But first of all, we're going to try its text to video. So simply click on this create and here you just have to type your prompts. I'm going to go ahead with the 22 years old German woman walking on a street cinematic. And next we have to select the style. And in the style section, we have two styles, realistic and anime. So I'm going to go ahead with the realistic one. Uh, and then we also have the option to enter the negative prompt. So if you want to enter any negative prompt, so I just added no blur and we have the aspect ratio option. So we have the major aspect ratio. So I'm going to go ahead with the 16 ratio 9. And uh, this is the characters option uh, that I'm going to explain it in the video. This is a really good feature. But for now, simply hit generate. Okay, the videos are ready and it gave us four different variations of the same video. And that's a really good thing. I haven't seen any other AI tool that gives you uh, four different video variations. So we're going to look at the first one. So this is the first video and it looks really smooth. Uh, we don't have any flickering effect on the eyes, but uh, yeah, there is uh, some kind of flicker on the last moment of this video. But overall, if we look at the initial frames, it looks really good. The movement looks really natural. The shoulder movement, it looks really, really natural. This is the second video. This is also really good. Uh, there is some thing going on with eyes, but I think this is acceptable. We can fix this by generating different videos. And this is the third video. And this is the fourth video. And this one actually really realistic. We don't have any flickering effect. We don't have any funkiness on the eyes. The eyes looks really good. Even the background looks really, really natural. So this is really realistic actually. So this time I'm gonna go with a beautiful German girl on a street posing seductively cinematic. And I'm gonna use the anime style this time, okay? So if you wanna use the negative prompt, you can use this, but I'm not gonna use this. And the aspect ratio will be 16 ratio 9 and hit generate. By the way, if you don't want a four variations of your video, and if you want your videos to generate quickly, you also have that command. So you can type forward slash and you can select the create single, right? And here you can type any prompt, a couple on a beach, romantic environment and sunset. And again, I'm gonna select the anime style. So in the single video option, we have one more option that is seed option. So the seed option is really, really useful. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead with the random seed number like this one and hit generate. Okay, so here we have the videos from our previous prompt, a German woman on a street. And this is not actually a German woman, but because this is the anime style, uh, we're gonna go ahead to the second video. Yeah, this one looks good. Uh, the main thing is the facial features are on point. Like if you look at this, the movement looks really, really subtle because we typed a seductive in our prompt and you can see there is a seductive look of this lady. Uh, so it also gets the prompt really, really good. So this is the third video. There is some kind of transition in this video. And uh, this is the last video. So these are the results from a couple on a beach romantic environment and this is the video from a single one and look at this one this one amazing this one is really really good we have that anime kind of uh, look on the background you get the skies and the water splashes look really really natural look at the water waves it looks really natural obviously we don't have much motion on the main subjects but uh, still it looks really really good 
Now let's try its characters option that I was talking about previously. So if you want to generate the Genshin characters, you have the built-in option for that. So I'm gonna go ahead with the prompt like a superhero girl, energy waves, warrior. And in the style section, I'm gonna go ahead with the anime style. And now I'm gonna select the character. So here we have a complete list of characters. So I'm gonna go ahead with the first one and uh, the aspect ratio will be 16 ratio 9 and hit generate. So now we have our character videos. So this is the first video. We have those energy waves in it and and we have the same character in all of these videos. So this is the second video. This one is pretty cool. This is the third video. The good thing about this AI tool that it gives you four different variations. So you don't need to worry about the results because you are getting four different variations. And also this is a free AI tool. So if you don't get the good results, you can always regenerate your videos and then you will have four different variations. So you can pick one of them that you like. Now we're gonna try its face swapping option that is one of my favorite option and for that you have to type forward slash and then select the meme face. Now you have to upload the face of your character. So let's say I'm gonna upload the face of this lady. In the prompt section I'm gonna type a Korean girl wearing cap and the aspect ratio will be 16.9 and hit generate. Okay so this is the output video and let's look at that. It's amazing. Just look at that, this is the same character. Uh, if I play this one more time, look at that. This is the same character. If we look at the image and if we look at the video, it's 90% getting it right. So it's amazing if you want to create the consistent characters. Now let's try its image to video. And uh, for that, again, forward slash. And now you have to select the animate. So here we have to upload the input image. So let's say I'm gonna go ahead with the this image. So in the image to video, we have the motion and the seed option. So in the motion section, you can type the motion, how much motion do you want. Uh, so let's say I'm going to keep the motion values around 5 and hit generate. Okay, so this is the output video and you can see there is a rainy really slow motion in this video. This is because of the motion values because we have selected motion value 5. So I'm going to again upload the same image but with the higher motion values. Okay, so here we have the results from the motion value 8 and now you can see we have much more motion in the video and the best thing it's not making it weird like it's not changing the facial features and all that stuff it's making a really sudden movements in it that looks really natural and recently they have introduced their image to video option so you can go to the generate image server type slash image so I'm gonna type like a cyberpunk woman pop dress holding a neon bar and you guys can also control the aspect ratio and for that you have to type dash dash size and now you have to type the aspect ratio so I'm gonna go with the like 16 ratio 9 so these are the output images so we have the four images first one she's holding a juice in second one she's holding also a juice kind of thing and the quality is acceptable so we also have some other options here you can upscale it like if you want to upscale the first one you can click on the u1 and this is the output image that looks a decent quality but mainly it's about the image to video text to video you can generate your favorite gaming characters in it you guys can use the face swapping option to generate the consistent characters in it so it all depends on you this is right now in beta this is free to use and the link is in the description below go ahead and check it out